Piranha Prowler only, the format you've all been waiting for. This vehicle is easily one of the worst in the game due to its enormous hitbox, but with everyone on it, you guys are in for the goofiest tournament of all time. In this KO, it is double elimination all the way until the finals, 5 races per GP, and 15 points per bonus item. Be sure to subscribe as we are getting closer to 500k subscribers, and let me know in the comment section what knockout format would you like to see next. It is time we start dabbling with the ultimate meme formats and what better way to start it than the Prana Prowler. I'm going for the full weight bonus today with Wario. Might change it up later, might go Funky Kong, not sure. We got a wide array of heavyweight combos here. It looks like Bowser, quite a few King Boos actually. I think there's probably more King Boos than Funky Kongs on the minimap. And so far, oh. Oh, oh, someone is on the Flame Runner. Yozo is about to get booted from the room. Great, love that. Love it when people don't pick the right combo. <laughs> Yozo can be really funny to see what placement they get this race. Are they going to get first? Or are they going to lose to a bunch of Prada Prowlers? Which would be quite hilarious. Snaking up a storm here. It's going pretty well so far. I'm gonna try to get a mushroom. Just gotta watch out for patties. Is it a uh, single banana? Okay, not bad. That's fine. Only one banana. We're gonna be able to drift here. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Just had to avoid the fake item box. Go for snipe. Okay, gotta stay wide here. Even though it's such a meme format, it's still going to be a very serious, you know, knockout tournament because the races are slow, so there's going to be a lot of intense moments, as per usual. Alright, the Flame Runner player is in fifth right now. This is very funny. We're getting this. This is a good pull. We're going inside. We're chaining. Is one mushroom going to be enough? Let's find out. Oh, yeah, fourth, fourth place, I think. Okay, it doesn't tell me what placement I got until the very end, that was intense. And most importantly, let's see what placement <laughs> the Flame Runner player got. The Flame Runner player ended up getting first place. Cool. It was pretty expected the Flame Runner was gonna get first place in this room, but for a moment there, I thought he might finish in the bottom. We were like doing a pretty good job as a Prana Prowling squad here, <laughs> just wreaking havoc. That was quite funny. Well, that didn't work. Now I'm gonna get double redded. Okay, so my strategy totally failed there. That was a pretty good throw. I'm surprised no one hit it. All right, we're back. We're snaking. Oh, okay, I do not have the weight advantage over Funky Kong by that much. I'm just gonna use it, honestly. I'm not gonna get the chain, but there's... Maybe, wait. Aw, uh, that's... That's a pretty good bullet, though. And we're actually just barely able to make that corner. Okay, okay, let's get the item. Let's pull triple mushrooms. Only a single mushroom. I'm gonna get passed by a lot of people here. This is actually really, mm, should've used it earlier. Okay, I think I can still get seven. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, seventh place. Oh, this is stressful. These races are super close. It's just impossible to break away. Everyone's going super slow. That is why we're only doing five race GPs because this is, it's like playing on 100 CC today, even though we're on 150. We are at 11, it's 15 points per bonus item. Jamie, Black Hat in trouble. There's only one more elimination because Yozo chose the Flame Runner and we got three races to go. I think the bonus items are gonna matter more than ever, considering how slow everyone's going. It's it's gonna be such an advantage on the tracks that have shortcuts at the very end too, like right there when the shock is used and everyone's going super slow. If I had a bonus item, I could have triggered that, pulled mushrooms and got like third or something. Like it was the difference of like six to seven points just having one or not. So it's extremely important to not only avoid elimination, but also get at least 30 points in the GP minimum 15. Although if you're not getting 15 anyway, you're probably getting eliminated in five races. We're not going for shortcut. 
I'm gonna try my best to play safe and smart. Easier said than done. And we're we're also not gonna hold our dodge, dodge items too long here. Can I get the item? Yes. Nice. Something hit him. I'm not sure if it was me or not, but we take those. All oh, right, after the item set, we are gonna get the boost panel. First place did not get target shocked. These ramps are great when you're small. You go the same speed in the air and then right hit the ground. 74 kmh while boosting. Pretty funny. All right. Bottom route again. And we hit a lot of offer there. It's really hard for me to see the difference in terrain, especially on this monitor. It looks it looks the same. Like I can't tell where the off-road is. Okay. It'll look brighter on YouTube. It always does. I'm just gonna have to mushroom through that part next lap. The King Boos are all in the top spots right now. Nice. So happy I used that. Didn't want to hold my dodge item too long. Gotta stick to that strategy. Because people, they're gonna fall behind. They're just gonna have to use the shock. It's gonna be really hard to, to keep it. We got big so quick, I was not ready for that. All right, I'm just gonna go bottom route. Blue shell, okay. I just don't know how much it's gonna matter. This race is nothing like the first two. Just gonna go wide. Yeah, he swerved, hit me there. There was no way that should have hit me. Playing very dirty here. And I'm worried I'm gonna get started here. I'm gonna go wide. Okay, I can see the off-road now. I'm just gonna use it. It's been a rough race here. The Rosalina player got wrecked. They were so far ahead, the blue shell must have led to a combo. Once again, super close pack. Go, go, go. This is actually such a good pull. I think I got fifth. Every race is gonna be like this. It's just gonna be the last set, everyone in a cluster, and then who pulls the best items. That is what I'm learning so far. We got our first bonus item. Last place is Black Cat with one. Jamie is at three. Feeling pretty good about this GP. 13 points to get to 30 and two races to go. All right, only three laps. Only gonna be one shock this race. And it's just, I'm gonna try to front run. It's seriously gonna come down to who dodges, who gets the shock, and there might not even be a blue shell this race. That's why I wanna try front running it. I'm just gonna try to snake this section. Let's see how this goes. Okay, I'm gonna try to get orange here. Not bad. OGM, I thought was gonna bullet me, but we're good. If I could just get to 32 here, we're set. And then, I mean, theoretically, if I got 32 here, I can get to 47 next race and get three bonuses. Come on. More main turbo chaining, let's go. Not bad. It, it all comes down to if there's a blue shell or not. Even if there's a blue shell, it's not the end of the world here. Because I actually have a pretty big breakaway. I'm not even going to mess with blow tricks. I'm just going to play it safe. Hopefully no one pulls it here. I think we're good. Yes. It all came down to the very first item box on lap one. I used my mushroom, it got me into first, and then nobody was able to catch me, and there's no shortcuts, and it was just an easy race. I mean, totally different from the first three. Quite nice, honestly, and that puts us at two bonuses. It puts us in third place overall on the GP. Uh, much creeps in first, not too surprised. And looking at the bottom here, it looks like Roxy is not actually in this room. I thought Roxy was, must have not got in in time. These rooms fill up fast, so it is literally just a mad dash to get one of those 11 spots. One thing I need to be really careful about is just not accidentally using my bonus item. It is something that happens to me so much, like I'll fall off and I'll just rest my controller on my lap and then it'll just 
be on the L button and I will spam a bonus item and I won't even know it until like three races later. I'm sure you guys have seen it happen a million times at this point. So that is another challenge with bonus items. Yes. I'm gonna lay this right when I land. That should be a hazard if someone takes inside lane. Yes, it worked. Oh, that was bad. All right, all right, we're getting to drift speed. If you're not at drift speed and you hit something or you get shocked or whatever, you get wheelie bumped, you wanna get to drift speed ASAP and then get a major blast to get to full speed. So, you know, that, that's especially true with bikes with the wheelie, but with carts, it's it's all about, you know, just keeping that main turbo speed as much as possible, finding ways to squeeze out blues and oranges. It's a lot different than what we've been playing recently with Retro Rewind and how we've had the purple main turbo and the inside drift purples have been just absolutely insane. So, it's a lot different here because it's like, I mean, the, the orange main turbo, it only gets you to like, flame runner wheelie speed and then it doesn't even last that long especially with vehicles like this like it's it's extremely underwhelming the best thing this this vehicle has going for it by far is is just the fact that uh, i'm so screwed yeah they, they have no mercy on me anymore i'll tell you that much these rooms are very competitive compared to how they used to be i feel like they used to be like three years ago pretty chill what why am i going this way are you kidding All right, we're gonna get some points. That's fine. We're not getting another bonus item. Blue shell combo, just a sitting duck. I am not playing nice today. If there's one thing I've learned about this first UP is these people, they came to play and we are not messing around. That's the only way we're gonna make it to the end. Black Cat is out, but at least they chose the Piranha Prowler and now two more eliminations next UP. And I mean, I think I'm gonna try Funky Kong now. With the Wario experiment, I didn't feel like I really had any advantage when everyone is already so heavy. Okay. I don't think I should've taken the shot. I think this is slower. I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah. Oh, did I get, oh! No, give him back, give him back! Yes! Get away! Oh, this is it! Oh, this is incredible. I get to go 95 during this whole section right here. Hopefully not hit the, hopefully not hit the wall. Hit the wall immediately, cool. Okay, okay. I need to get at least a blue shell lead. Failed to do that last race, got decimated. And it's a new GP here, so the points reset and nothing really matters about prior races aside from bonus items, which will help me at the end of a GP, but we do not want to use them this early. You can accumulate up to nine bonuses. I would love to have nine going into the finals or semifinals. I'm gonna lay more traps. Yes, connected. All right, so the good news is, even if I got blued, I feel like I would still be in second can't ask for much more. There's probably gonna be one. It's just the races are so long here. Uh, I mean, I can predict the future. I hope I'm in second now. I don't wanna get double blue shell. I'm not in second. What? Okay, luckily that was trickable. I was about to be in so much trouble. He could definitely backspam me. I wanna take the safest lines I can. Oh, I'm really worried about, okay, this is great. I was really worried about this section. Yes. That could have been so much worse. Come on, mushroom. Throwing it. That's gonna connect. Second place, this is so hilarious. This is how I imagine a one CC knockout tournament. I mean, I'm exaggerating, but it seriously feels that level of slowness and just a cluster. Every single race almost has had a cluster at the end. It's quite fascinating. It's like a totally different way to play Mario Kart. There's no breakaways. It's just impossible. All right. <sighs> this is gonna be hilarious. Dodging the crabs is gonna be impossible. I don't know how I'm gonna do it. If I'm gonna do it. Let's see, let's see how this first round goes. Ah! All right, so we have, I mean, 
we evaded the crabs, but at, at what cost? Had to lose about three seconds. The good thing is, it seems like everyone is having trouble with it. Third place box mushroom? That's, that's even better. I'm only three points away from my third bonus. I have successfully not used the bonus item, which I'm very happy about, on accident. See, I really was hoping that the off-road stat that Funky Kong gives, okay, there's one crab. We knew that was gonna happen. But I was really hoping that it would help me drift through certain types of terrain, and uh, it does not work for the grass on this one. The off-road stat is not good enough on the Prowler Prowler. That would have been very helpful. So even if I hit the off-road, Funky Kong's off-road stat is gonna help me very little, it seems like. Maybe there's another type of off-road terrain where it'll help more, like maybe like Rome Volcano style terrain, which is the same as, oh my god, I can't hit this. Epic fail. I'm not using bonus. I'm just gonna tough it out. It's still very close. I'm gonna try to get two items here. Okay, we're actually getting one, wow. I don't know, we're not getting this one. I'm just gonna have to spam it. I don't like this position very much. It might work out for me. That was actually insane. We're not getting first, we get second? Oh my gosh, I got second place, wow. The good thing about this is everything is so slow that you can really like figure out how things are gonna end before they end. Like right there, I look back and I was like, oh, like I have like a few seconds on third place right now and everyone can't really catch you unless there's a blue shell. So the races are so slow paced that it seems to be working in my advantage so far. I mean, we were so far behind entering lap three and we just got second. I could actually see people getting breakaways on this track. There's gonna be a little more tech than what we're getting in the first seven or eight. And it's gonna be about how people take this beginning section along with the half the half pipe section. I don't think it's really worth bouncing off the wall, but much creeps did it, so maybe I'm wrong. And he already has five bonuses, which does not bode well for the rest of us. Alright, we're gonna get double trick here. Beautiful. Incredible pow dodge. I could not have done that better in 100 attempts. But I didn't realize I had two bananas and I didn't spam item, so I'm sitting with one here. Gotta get this item. Beautiful. Okay, we're actually doing amazing so far. Just gotta keep back spamming, honestly. This is very good. having trouble controlling this, but we are hitting people. Okay, we got it. Get the trick boost. That's the key. <laughs> Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Strat. Hit the banana, dodge the blue shell. If only it were that simple. All right, just like that, we're in seventh. Yep, this is how it's gonna go. Look, look at the cluster right now. This is comical. It's all about who's good at item management for this, this event today. I think I should chain it. I'm gonna hold it. I'm gonna hold it for the shortcut. That's unfortunate. I'll go for item here. I'm gonna get mushroom. Yeah. Okay. Wall bounce. Yeah, that's why I didn't want to go for wall bounce. I was afraid of that. But we're still in it right now. Dodge the bomb. Just saw that in time. Don't put me in first. I don't want to be in first right now. That's great. It's so intense right now. I'm not going to get the item. Go, go, go. Look at this. Oh, this is crazy. It's also the reason I had to go Funky Kong. The speed stat is gonna really make a difference. Like I would have probably, almost certainly, let's be honest, gotten fifth place if it wasn't for Funky Kong's speed bonus at the end. And it's just an amazing GP here. We got 32, we're only losing to much creeps. And we got another bonus item, so we're sitting at four right now. I do not have a good feeling about this one. I don't know how I'm gonna do the ending of the track. I feel like I should just go wide because I can't imagine having to weave between the grass mounds and the moles with this combo, I just can't see it. I, I just think it's a terrible idea. Hopefully I can front run and just forget 
this track even exists. Over time, I've grown to dislike this track more and more. Oh, perfect timing to say that. You see, what, what, what was that? Oh, thank you, Kurt. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think we're good now. <laughs> oh, that was fun. All right, let's see if we can front run. Got a little carried away. Well, I mean, Mario Kart's such a funny game. I make this catastrophic mistake where I hit the mole. It shoots me to the side. I am not able to even get a trick. I'm stuck in the off-road, and it leads me into a Mega Thundercloud. Like, just, what a great game. So I think I'm going to do this. I'm going to go wide. Oh, gosh, nowhere is safe. Nowhere is safe. I just lost my lead. Much Creeps just gained, like, three-plus seconds on me because of that one failure. I actually think that Much Creeps being in this room helps my chances of making the finals because I feel like he's going to... He's gonna win and be in first most of the time, which will protect me from getting blue shelled. Because that's what's really killed me the most so far, is just getting blue shelled. Okay, good thing I got that trick off. We're getting the item. I'm gonna go wide. I'm throwing this. Yes! First! Okay, I like this track now. No, I'm kidding. Let's be honest. It's one of the worst tracks. I don't know if it's worse in this game or 8 Deluxe. I seriously can't stand the track. All right, in last place with three points, we have a disconnection, Jamie. Jamie is out. We have nine players left. We have one more race to see who the last person getting eliminated before we have our final eight. This is where it starts to get serious. 25% of the room is gonna get eliminated, then it's 33%, then it's 50%. So uh, we, we have our bonus items stocked up. We might be going for a shortcut. I think I'm gonna give it an attempt on lap one. I seriously do. Much Creeps is proving to be the by far the biggest competition here. He has won both GPs. I thought Roxy was in the tournament, I was wrong. And I mixed up hers and OGM's meet, so. Yeah, I mean, that's going to definitely make it easier for us to make the finals, but it's not going to be free. There's still some good players in here uh, that can easily make it to the finals. And got to just be... I'm going to I'm gonna use my mushroom. Yeah, it's got to be careful. Can't get too confident here. That is how you lose in Mario Kart. The, the second you feel safe, that is when you're most vulnerable in this game. You have to just be looking out for everything and putting yourself in the best position to not get Mario Karted, and that's pretty much the name of the game, and it's no different here using Piranha Prowlers. I must say though, I do like using this combo a lot more when it's uh, just Piranha Prowlers, but it is it is a little slow. It makes me want to try a 200cc Piranha Prowler tournament, although that might be torturous. So, let me know in the comment section what 150cc, 200cc, or item range tournaments for knockouts, vehicle specific, or any sort of specific theme that you would like to see, let me know because uh, I can I can make it happen. Oh, I, thought, I thought I was gonna make it. All right, I'm not going for that again unless I have a mushroom. All right, top two just made shortcut with ease, and Hafer also made it, but he's crashing. Oh no no, he made it. He full on made it. Okay, we're in trouble. I'm throwing this. Come on, almost. The wide against secure box. This is the perfect item. And my shell connects! Everything's going right for me now. I need the draft. That was just evil. Alright, at least it gives me a great respawn. I just have to use it. I'm gonna use my bonus. See how many points this gets me. I'm not. I'm not gonna use a bonus. I'm, I'm just gonna see if I can get second. So worth it. If I don't use that bonus, I'm getting six. I'm getting two points. Instead, I am getting eleven. Oh, it's gonna be intense. This is gonna be intense. Hafer, Kurt, Much Creeps, Patty, like all these people have put up points. I don't know who's gonna make it to the finals, honestly. Like, all it takes is one bad GP. These GPs are short. Patty just dominated, and Much Creeps got seventh, and I was gonna get sixth if I didn't use that bonus. 
the biggest fear I have about doing a 200cc Prana Prowler knockout is, is just that um, some people would really struggle with the brake drifting and then the races wouldn't be super close, high octane and adrenaline inducing. And they might feel a little bit like, oh, okay, some people break away and then it just creates like miniature clusters of two to three players while instead we have one giant cluster of 12 or 10 or eight. And it's been, uh, it's been pretty glorious. <laughs> I wonder, like, it'd be really fun to have everyone on Prana Prowler and they have to keep the one Flame Runner from winning the GP, but they can't go backwards. Like, I think that would be a good challenge. That, that, would, that would be worth, like, testing out. If you guys have any ideas like that with certain vehicles, let me know. In the past, we've done, like, can the 200cc Jet Setter defeat the 150cc top tiers? Like, we've done stuff like stuff like that, but um, I'm sure there's, like, more ideas we can flesh out in the format. I, I wouldn't say for a KO tournament. It'd be more for, like, a 12 race, like, FFA, that style. But I, I feel like there's some, some good ideas that can be brought to life there, so. We'll see. Oh, the ice is so, so slippery. Did not think I would hit that. So yeah, we've changed our character twice already. I don't know what I'm going to be doing for the, the next GP yet. It's going to really just depend how this goes. The Funky Kong GP, though, was my best. So I might be going back to Funky Kong. Oh! All right, we're, we're on a tear right now. Good thing I got that major while out. Although I was not able to maintain much of my speed. Bring that close, let's go. Considering I already have double digit points, I don't think I want to burn a bonus this race. I want to see how many I'm at after like four, three or four races. I get a bottom spot though, it's gonna be close. This is intense, can I get a draft? No, I can get green though, cool. There's much creeps. I'm using bonus. That was so worth it, oh my god. Best bonus items ever. I don't even have to use any more bonuses for the rest of the GP. I'm like 100% safe. I'm already sitting at 26 and Patty has 26. Huckster has zero and Much Creeps has five. I don't have to use any more bonuses. I got another bonus. I'm gonna get another one at four points. This, G this GP could not be going any better. I cannot believe this. All right, another semi-difficult track. I love this one. In the new version, there is like a upwards banked helix in place of where the loop usually is and where the corkscrew is at the, oh, got some air. Uh, the corkscrew at the end of the level is still like a, kind of like a wavy trickable road, just as it was in the past. So uh, yeah, I really, really enjoyed this one. I think it's a great take on DS Rainbow Road, which was one of my favorite tracks growing up. Like I was a huge fan of this one on Mario Kart DS. I play it all the time. I pick it online as well. And there are some really cool shortcuts, although you couldn't really take advantage of the shortcuts when playing Mario Kart DS Online since Mario Kart DS Online was actually 100cc. And that mattered. Oh, oh, I missed. That's not good. I missed again. Patty dodged everything. But anyway, what I was going to say is 100cc on that game, it didn't matter as much as it matters in this game because there was snaking, and it made the snaking and the prolonged rocket boosting strategy. It made it a lot easier on 100cc, so that was like the benefit of 100. Although it did make a handful of shortcuts, like the Delfino scored double shortcut, it's not really viable options online. And yeah, I mean, this one and Wario Stadium and Peach Gardens, Delfino were my go-tos. Another thing about Mario Kart DS online that was interesting, you could not pick all the tracks. I'm not kidding. There were only 20, I think, out of 32 tracks were playable. They had like certain cups, they'd have all the tracks, and then other cups, they'd only have two of the four tracks playable. And I think it had to do something with like the more complicated tracks 
being taken out are the ones with a lot of objects that cause lag. Like, I'm pretty sure you couldn't play Shroom Ridge. You couldn't play DS Bowser's Castle. Um, I don't even... You couldn't play Waluigi Pinball. What I would do, though... Terrible fail. Not like it matters to me at this point. I'm safe. But, uh, anyway... What, what was so cool is there was an action replay code that would make it so you could pick tracks that were not votable and then everyone would play them and there was no problems with the tracks. Like, maybe there would be like a slight bit of lag or something, but I didn't really notice it. And I think people loved when I would pick tracks like Waluigi Pinball online and then uh, we'd be all playing tracks that nobody usually gets to play. That was such a cool feature. Mario Kart Wii, they obviously fixed it. All the tracks are playable. We have 100 plus tracks in every custom track distribution. But back in the day, the very first online Nintendo game, Mario Kart DS, you only play 20 tracks online without cheats. Five bonuses. How much does much creeps have? That's the question. He has six, and he's probably going to start burning them to be safe. Got two more races here. I mean, we're just getting started on this GP. Might get bulleted here. <laughs> yeah, this thing has the biggest hitbox. I just knew it. I just knew it. I knew there was no way I was evading that. All right. Skip this item. Oh, get wrecked hype speed. And it was a star. So worth it. Considering I'm in seventh, though, I think the best plan of action is just to use it. Sixth place item. Let's see what we get. Couldn't be better. I'm chaining it. Had to release my blue mage turbo. Yeah, I connected. It, it, you can't evade this thing. You just can't. Like, if you want to hit someone, you're going to hit them. And that's the Prana Prowler. I seriously just pulled a mushroom. I, I got a break. I can't be hitting hate for screenshot right now. If anything, being in second is the best. First the worst, second the best. That's Mario Kart. Especially these knockout tournaments. Okay, I almost got wrecked. I, I did get wrecked. <laughs> At least I didn't get double wrecked. I could have got Monty Mold right there and we'd be raging. Yeah, the <laughs> the orange main turbo is equivalent to like a blue main turbo on the mock bike. This is silly. Th th wow. Oh! I did not do the best job of hitting both those mushrooms. I had an idea and it half worked and I'm still in third, so I shouldn't be complaining. Yes. Oh, they stole both items. Hopefully they don't have like a... I was about to say that. Oh my gosh, that's too funny. This is okay. I can dodge. Get third or something. Okay, I think I got fourth. I at least got fifth at the worst. And I should be at another bonus. Oh, we got we got third place, and it looks like Huckster is out, cannot recover, eliminated by default, and hype speed is almost out. But we are gonna play the last race. Should, should I go for it? I'm I'm not gonna go for it. I'm gonna fail it. Let's be honest. Now I have to use this. <laughs> I thought I was gonna land up top for a moment there. How am I not in last? That's the better question though. Like, how, how am I not in last after what happened? I have to say, so I have got this idea in the comments from you guys over the years and the people who joined these tournaments, Bodation Nation has been asking for Prana Prowler KO for years and I just thought it would be really stupid and boring. It has delivered. This is very entertaining. <laughs> it's a totally different game. It, it's one of the most foreign feeling vehicles in the game so uh, I'm really enjoying it. It feels fresh. It feels fresh and it's a lot more fun than I ever anticipated. So we might be doing more meme formats and you guys are in for a treat. 
Wow, I went for the wide box, but hype speed was on it. Yeah, not messing with that. I, I'm not gonna use a bonus. I'm, I'm not gonna be able to get first, so there's no point in me using one. Uh, it's okay if I get a bomb spot here. I could probably get fit though. Fit. Fourth. It's just going so well for me today. It's like I can't even get a bomb spot. Hopefully my luck continues next GP, and it looks like hype speed is out, getting six points. Made it to the final race though. 50 points. First place, this might be my tournament. I don't know, let's see. Grumble, okay, getting a lot of the regs showing up today. A lot of my favorites, and Moomoo Meadows. <laughs> but this should be a fun time. I am not going for a rock hop, most likely, but well, we'll see, we'll see. Kurt still rocking his me. Going for the snipe. Red shell snipe. <laughs> Aw, let's go. Patty's gonna try to steal it right here, huh? I just need to preserve this. I think I got it. Nice. Not gonna risk the shortcut, just gonna take safe lines. Nobody made cut. My position counter changed to second. I think someone went for cut and just barely failed it. So I was hoping to like, get like a second place box there and potentially pull a mushroom, then I would be set. Completely just GG's. But the strategy now is I need to backspam everything. It's just so hard to evade traps. I just gotta go crazy with it. Okay, we connected. Didn't hit second though. I think this is gonna be the never mind, not worth it. Not worth it. Terrible. I was like, this is gonna be the plan of action, but nope. Yeah, everyone's failing the shortcut. Once again, a King Boo went for it. Did not get it. I think you gotta jump for the Lava Glitch. I don't know if you could TF input this <laughs> with the Prana Prowler, I, I don't know. This is a great banana spot, especially with half of the floor just gone. It's really a totally different track and people aren't making rock hop. Totally different track. I feel like I've almost used enough items to, to get a mushroom in first. It sucks. Yes! That was beyond lucky. Luckiest race ever. So unbelievably lucky that the red shell, the second red, is about to hit me and my ground banana saves me. Unbelievable. This just feels like my tournament right now. Seven bonuses. And I've used two of them. Like, it's gonna be a bonus item frenzy next GP. I might start using them now. I'm definitely not safe yet. I want to at least have five or six for next GP, and then three or four for the finals. Whew. Okay, that went better than expected. Just gonna be very careful. Hafer's throwing everything back right now. Maybe I can connect this on him right here. Let's see. Beautiful. I'm okay with front running now. There's less people. There's less chance of a blue, it feels like. Okay, I, I did not get the trick, but at least I didn't fall off. Patty Smart going wide. I doubt anyone's gonna do the big shortcut, so nothing to worry about there. And Kurt is in last by quite a bit right now. The shock is still in play in six player rooms. Six player rooms are the dumbest and wonkiest format in Mario Kart Wii. I mean, there, there's just the silliest point distribution and then also, the shock is only available in six. It just feels weird it's even an option in a six player room. We're doing great here. Throw it back. Should connect. Nope. Oh, never mind. Cool. 
Yeah, we, we have a breakaway now. I, I think I could even tank a blue shell and get first or second. Don't know if tricking really does anything there. It's been the least eventful race of the entire day. Surprising. Oh. Okay, we're good, we're good. Yeah, I lost a lot of time. Now, if I get blued, I'm getting third at best. Just gonna hold this. I think I'm good. I think I'm good, yeah. It wasn't pretty, but I got the win. That's what matters. I don't know who got second. There's two Rosalinas and two other King Boos. Okay, Hafer pulls out second. OGM, she gets third, which means Much Creeps is only at nine points. This would be huge if Much Creeps gets knocked out early. My road to the finals is much easier if that's the case. Cool. Doesn't matter on this track, lots of shortcuts. She got a mushroom. Oh, 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 oh. Yikes. <laughs> a blooper. All right, I mean, the item distribution is hilarious in six player rooms. Everything about six player is goofy. There's one thing I learned though. King King Boo is the best. King, King Boo is the best for the Promer Collar. I'm convinced. It has been easier than ever for me. I, I, the race results speak for themselves. Maybe the luck has also been there with King Boo. There's definitely some truth to that. Funky Kong felt good. Wario, it felt like the, the weight didn't do anything at all. So uh, I think it's between Funky Kong and King Boo. And I mean, it's interesting though. We have players using Rosalina and I think that's for the main turbo bonus. Maybe Rosalina is better than Funky Kong. It's just really interesting to see not a single Funky Kong in the final six. And that's one thing that makes it really fun to use these like weird formats and try try all this out. You, you have some unexpected results. We're used to Funky Kong being just used more than every other character combined. Without, it goes without saying. And you know, we play these jank formats like 99999cc and then Funky Kong becomes extinct. But the heavyweight vehicles are still good. It, it's very surprising. Like the meta was a uh, Wario bike, King Boo for 99999. And here, King Boo proving to be the most popular character in the format. We'll see how it shakes out next GP. I am making it to the next round, guaranteed. Gotta get this box. I don't think that was my green, yeah. That was funny though. Not good. I'm just gonna cut it really inside here. That was actually phenomenal. Let's go. Wow, that could not have been better. I'm using my mushroom so I could chain. Okay, so first had a mushroom. We, we're getting second. Cool. It's so odd. Like the first two GPs, the races were a lot more stressful. And then these last two, I feel like things have just gotten easier. I didn't expect this. I thought it would be the other way around. I actually feel really confident going into the semifinals, just how this GP is going and how the last one went. The max amount of bonus items you can have is nine. So I'm almost there, which means I will start using bonus items if I get to nine, like every single race. There's no reason not to. Ouch. Too much grass. Going for an evil snipe. <laughs> We're both at eight right now, respectively. Patty has only one, which is very surprising. I might go for shortcut. I'm really surprised that red actually went for Haper. That was really lucky. 
Red shots can be a little unpredictable in this game. That should connect. Never mind. I'm just gonna hold these. Oh, that went the wrong direction. I was supposed to go forward. Alright, maybe it'll be a good thing. Maybe the blue show will come. The mushroom saved me. I was I was done. It was an extremely close finish. We don't have the time on on this mod, but I, it was all within a second, 100%. We're at 50 again. Look at this. Oh my gosh, if Hafer gets first, any of them could go. OGM, Sports Mix, Much Creeps, AKA, and uh, Patty. I mean, I don't know what's gonna happen here. This is gonna be so intense. We got nine bonuses. Might as well use a bonus. I just get to relax this race. There's there's actually no point for me to even use bonus now that I think about it Because I could potentially not get another bonus. Yeah, there's, there's no point for me to use one I'm already safe and I'm already at nine. We, we, we've maxed out everything right now. This is the best possible Situation I could be in going into the semis I feel like I'm, I'm doing better at the, the cart snaking overall. Like, that's what's made the difference here. I'm actually able to, to break away a little bit. Is it even worth it to snake with this thing? I don't know, but I'm doing it anyway. I feel like it is. It feels faster, and I am getting breakaways. So I'm doing, I'm doing something right today. I just gotta keep doing what I'm doing. Like, look at this lead I have. Unbelievable. Yeah, I'm 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 looking like a Piranha Prowler veteran right now. Alright, we're gonna be front running this. I don't think anyone's catching me this race. Might as well go on another Mario Kart DS monologue. <laughs> so first of all, uh, like and subscribe, because we just made the semifinals. This is hype. And this is gonna be just a very exciting ending. I hope I make it to the finals. It could be against anyone at this point. I really, I really don't know who's going to be there in the finals. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be close next G GP. Like we've had a lot of GPs where the end of the leaderboard has been pretty, pretty brutal. Like a lot of single point finishers, a lot of disconnections today. But look, look at this breakaway. No blue shells once again. I'm not even using any items. I don't even need to. Even if there's a blue shell, I still won. Like, the chance of two blue shells is pretty slim. And a lot of people don't really care for this track. I've, I've seen, like, it's not that popular of a track from what I've gauged talking to others that, like, play retros. But I really enjoy this one. I actually like this track backwards a lot. It used to be a mission in Mario Kart DS. You could play the track backwards. There was a sick shortcut. It's not really the case, you know? And, and there's no like, well actually there is one shortcut, it's on 200cc, you can do a cool gap cut using the wooden ramp, but there's no like other cool shortcuts on 150 going forwards, but uh, always love this track, it has a star box in Mario Kart DS, and a mushroom box here. So Hafer ends up getting out, and Patty ends up getting another bonus, but things are interesting. We have quite the final four here. I think we have the players that have performed the best overall in the GPs in the final four. Uh, there's no surprises and it's gonna be close. I, I think it's gonna really come down to the tracks here and we're randomizing everything. So, I mean, I'm just hoping for no Luigi circuit, nothing super silly. I'm gonna use the bonus item right away. I'm gonna try to back spam. Yes, oh, it paid off. Oh, that was so worth it. I think I even got them off the edge. Shouldn't have tricked. Wow, I was lucky. My mistake ends up slowing much groups. Love that for myself. If I did not use that bonus, I'm probably off the edge right now. 
This is a whole... This is a whole different game. Not tricking. Just drifting. So much concentration on this track. This will be the hardest one of the whole video. I'm happy it's not the finals for this one. I need first right now. Wow, OGM is dominating. I, I don't know, I think a red shell hit her or something. Cause, cause uh, I, th I think she did the moon jump. Like, I, I don't know what just happened, but I, I got past there. Could have been a draft. Ah, there it is. Sent so many trouble, I think. Yeah, just getting clobbered now. Oh, last place. Everyone's good now. I'm using this immediately. Yes, there's a box. Oh gosh. I gotta go for an item. I'm gonna hold this. There's one here. Okay, well, I'm not gonna get last this race. That's good. But we're in a lot of trouble here. Okay, okay this is gonna be really close. Side red. All right. Well, it didn't matter. I need to. I need to sit here. Third. That was a brutal race. I almost just threw it all away. I'm happy to get third. Oh my gosh. Couldn't have gone worse. Almost. I'm gonna go wide and use the bonus. I think and chain. Maybe get a star or mega. Ah. Alright, at least I have an item, because all three got taken anyway. Yeah, I'm using it, and I am hopefully gonna pass much creeps. Okay, he doesn't have an item. I'm going wide. I don't trust him to spare me in any way. This part is really nerve wracking because there's nothing I can do if he drops something. We're good. Does he have a mushroom in first? Maybe. This is so painful. Okay, I'm just gonna use it. I get the box. Okay, that's fine. It's pretty good. And I gotta start using it now. I think this could get me in a second, maybe. Yeah. We need a blue shell. That's such a good pull. Okay, these items save me here. Yes! Incredible. 
Incredible. I could not have done that better. Just dominated both of them at the end when I needed to most. Had to work for a second there. I am still in an elimination position. Fighting for my life right now. I'm gonna try the same strategy with the bonus. Let's see if it pays off. It's pretty good. I'm using another one. Mushroom in first. Beautiful. Bonus item strategy paid off. Let's see if we can front right now. I need to get far enough ahead where I can't get redded. And then I'll be able to tank a blue. This is so hard to drive. But I'm sure it's the same way for everyone else. It's so intense now. It was just smooth sailing for such a long time. And it's completely different now. I, I definitely have to go for a shortcut coming up. I don't even have a red shell lead, so it makes no sense not to. Everyone did shortcut, cool. That really sucks. I did that really nice. I'm throwing everything back now. Yes! Oh my gosh! Huge lead. If they do shortcuts, gonna be close though. Just can't make any mistakes. There's one mistake. Minor, thankfully. Connected. That's huge. That is huge. And I'll lay an annoying banana. Dodging anything is very difficult with this vehicle, so. Everything's paying off right now. Every single trap matters. Just gonna go wide. Can't risk it. That was everything. Perfectly strategized that race. And the red shell I pulled from the first bonus, then pulled a mega into the mushroom bonus. Just like that, I'm tied for first. And Much Creeps is in third right now. This is a long way from over, but I'm feeling a lot better now. Okay, I don't know if I want to go for shortcut, but I kind of feel like I should. I'm going to try to front run and not use any bonuses. For the beginning, at least. Might get owned here, let's see. A re -hop. I don't think I took the fastest way. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh gosh. <laughs> Here we go. Reality is setting in. I don't know how I'm going to play this track. This is a track that I have zero experience using cards, really. Some inside drift experience with cards, but not really outside drift. I feel like I don't know what's going on in this one. Like, when we play, like, Rainbow Road, even though I haven't really played it very many times with the Prana Prowler, I still have used cards so many times on base game tracks that I can uh, figure it out. I need at least third this race. I'm gonna hold this. Everyone's going the other way. That's very interesting. I want Patty to pass me. Did I connect? No. It was all lag. I gotta watch out for the green. I think the best plan of action would be, number one, to take the faster route that they're taking. And number two, to go for shortcut. I'm a little nervous going for it though. I'm gonna go for it. Not worth. It. Just I just slid. All right, let's see what I get. Amazing pull. <laughs> I 
This is so cheap. The bonus items are completely busted. Like, I'm not safe. I'm definitely not safe. It's very close, but wow, what a GP this has been. Whew. I need to not get last. That's, that's what it comes down to. I just need to not get last. Go, go, go. If I can break away here and just have someone fall behind by hitting a truck or whatever, then we're set. Just gotta play it safe and smart. Stay away from everyone. Oh, incredible. Incredible. This is so close. Does Patty have a golden? I'm taking this inside, I think. Yeah. That's an area where Funky Kong's off roads that would help to go faster by quite a bit on that section. Ah! Oh! oh, that's so bad. I'm in last! Okay, OGM also had a mistake. Yeah, Much Creeps lagged the bomb car, and that was very smart. You get close to the wheels on the bomb car, the hitbox, it just explodes online. It's super cheap and it's a very popular strategy. Online, you see people throw green shells into the bomb cars all the time to trigger them. Very smart strategy. Oh, I gotta use it. I'm gonna pow OGM and try to screw her over. And that's a success. Playing for third right now, it's totally different. Where is Patty? Oh, I knocked Patty off! Let's go! We are going to the finals. There is no way I lose this now. This would be huge if I can get another bonus item right now. The, the greens are coming. Um, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. We did it. We freaking did it oh my gosh this is just an incredible comeback i'm playing out of my mind today and i am facing ogm in the finals super unpredictable i thought for sure it would be patty or much creeps in the finals potentially both of them but it's me versus ogm here and i wish her the best of luck here we go seven bonuses i am the front runner here i don't even know how many ogm has five. Oh, never mind oh it's gonna be close sniped here somehow evaded that oh okay so it's all gonna be about the shortcuts on this one I need to get enough of a lead where oh gosh there's a red there's a red there's a red we're good I was, I was gonna say I need enough of a lead where like I have to force her to do the shortcut with a mushroom early and not just save mushrooms until the end and sandbag and then she's a win and I'm screwed over. Okay, this is terrifying. I gotta use a bonus. I pull a fake item. Oh, yes, okay, okay. That was actually worth it. Everything is okay. Everything's okay. This is intense right now. All right, she got the big shortcut. We're in trouble now. Wait, wait, no, she fell off. I have not won this. But our chances just doubled. There could still be a blue shell. And I gotta find a way to block that shortcut. Shortcut saves a lot. I'm trying to make it as difficult as possible. Even making her take wide lines would be really good right now. I'm not gonna trick, I think it's just good to do that. Yes. Wow. She got very, very unlucky. Not a single mushroom.
Definitely have the one. There could be a blue shell. I got this now. I got this. Yep. All right, she's in Mega. Lap two, oh, the beginning of it was so terrifying. Spamming my bonus, pulling a fake item box, and then backing the green, it doesn't hit the red, and it hits her. This is crazy. Yes, let's go. Oh, I feel so good on this one. I am gonna start spamming my bonuses at the very beginning of races, because if OGM decides to do that to me, then I'm gonna probably get redded. It's not gonna be a good time. I missed. Using a bonus. Oh, incredible bonus. Is she going for the double? I'm gonna go for the squish. I connected. I did. That was the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe shenanigans there. Oh, that was really bad. Okay, I'm still up three seconds, but I could be up like five seconds if I got that last corner. So really bad mistake. I am going to not even do shortcut here. I'm gonna go around and lay a fake item box here. Come on, come on, fall for the trap, please. Didn't fall for it or didn't hit it one or the other. This is terrifying. We're making it work, we're making it work. Very, very, oh! Okay, so a big fail at the end by her messed up the last corner. So now I have a five second lead. There's no need to do anything risky. Playing very safe. I should probably block the double. It's gonna be very close now. I'm gonna use a bonus. I'm just gonna go around. Come on, come on. Yes! Okay, the blue shell made things very interesting. I just got my item out from the bonus in case of a red shell. I did not want to lose in any stupid way. One more win and we are the Prana Prowler champion. All right. Okay. I love this track, but I'm not any good at it with cards. I have no idea how to do any of the tech. We won't be going for sand hop. We won't be going for wall glitch, really, unless we get it by accident. And we certainly won't be going for the ultra. Yeah, I, I have no idea how to do this. Uh, I'm gonna lose so much time here. Oh, gosh, that was horrible. Okay, I guess I'll throw it. That's good. I'll take a mushroom. Okay. I think I'm gonna use it here. Is this a bad idea? Let's find out. I'm gonna trick off this and just hop a million times. Oh, I'm using it, I'm using it. Oh, yes, go, go, go. No. Oh, dude, it's cracking on everything right now. This is such a good pull. Just what I needed. I'm back in it. Oh, interesting! Did not see that coming. Great low. I, I don't know what's going on. I'm so perplexed by that move right there. I have no idea how to do this part of the track, as you've seen the first two laps. 
Okay, the great thing is, is we both failed the wall glitch. I failed it all three laps, monumentally, catastrophically. Come on, come on. We did it! Oh, it feels great! That was so intense, and I seriously have never played this well in my life with the Prana Prowler. One of my best carding days in recent memory, and it feels good. It feels good to win one of these. It feels so difficult now to even win one of these in general, so I will take any W I can get. Great games to OGM. It was really impressive seeing her make the finals and knocking out Much Creeps and Patty, and overall, this is definitely gonna be a memorable one and we're gonna be playing a lot more meme formats because I enjoyed that way more than I expected. Be sure to comment below what knockout tournament would you like to see next. Thanks for watching, peace.